Have you ever felt like you were constantly striving, always trying to change something about yourself or the world around you? But it seemed like your efforts were in vain. In today's video, we're going to explore the ancient wisdom of Taoism, a philosophy that encourages us to embrace the concept of non-doing, to stop trying so hard to change things, and instead, find contentment in the natural flow of life. As we delve into this sage-old philosophy, we'll discover how trying to improve, trying to be happy, and trying to be someone you're not can lead to more dissatisfaction than fulfillment. But fear not, for the Taoists offer us a path to true contentment by simply letting go of the need to control and change everything. The Taoists, like Lao Tzu, remind us that those who stand on tiptoes do not stand firmly. Those who rush ahead don't get very far. Those who try to outshine others dim their own light. In their observation, humans tend to act in counterproductive ways, trying to change what nature has intended, like swimming against the stream. All the rules, ethics, and values we've invented were meant to benefit humanity. But according to the ancient sages, they only take us further from the natural flow of life. The Tao, often described as a mysterious and undefinable force, lies behind the ever-changing universe. It's beyond our senses, something we can feel but not truly comprehend. It symbolizes the human tendency to conceptualize things beyond our understanding, using names, categories, and labels Five colors blind the eye. Five notes deafen the air. Five flavors make the palate go stale. As Lao Tzu wrote, we use these categories to enhance our understanding, but limit it in the process. So, what does this mean for us in the modern world? Let's explore some examples of how we try using the ancient Taoist scriptures, the Tao Te Ching, and the Zhuangzi. Often, our desire to change the world for the better can lead to unintended consequences. Consider the example of communism, originally driven by a desire for equality and fair distribution. However, the methods used to spread this ideology were brutal, emphasizing the Taoist belief that imposing man-made ideas disrupts the natural course, as Confucius wisely pointed out. If you do not understand men's minds, but instead appear before a tyrant and force him to listen to sermons on benevolence and righteousness, measures and standards, this is simply using other men's bad points to parade your own excellence. Our relentless pursuit of happiness through wealth, status and achievements can leave us exhausted and unfulfilled. The Taoists suggest that true happiness lies in contentment not in the accumulation of material positions. We often strive to change who we are to fit societal ideals. The Taoists emphasize the importance of embracing our true selves and not trying to be something we're not. Nature created us with our unique attributes and they beauty in diversity in our daily lives. We often find ourselves wanting to control every aspect of our existence, from our schedules to our surroundings, this constant need for control can lead to stress and anxiety. The Taoist approach suggests that instead of trying to control everything, we should embrace the unpredictable nature of life. Letting go of the need for absolute control can be liberating. Consider how surrendering control in certain situations can lead to more positive outcomes, as it allows for spontaneity and unforeseen opportunities embrace the flow of relationships. Apply the principle of non-doing in your relationships by allowing them to evolve naturally. Instead of trying to force a specific outcome, be open to the ebb and flow of connections. Understanding that people change and relationships evolve. Embrace uncertainty. In a world that craves certainty, learn to embrace the uncertainty of life. The Taoist philosophy encourages us to let go of rigid expectations and find peace in the unknown. This acceptance of uncertainty can reduce stress and anxiety. Practice self-compassion. Extend the principle of non-doing to your self-care. 
Instead of relentlessly pursuing self-improvement, practice self-compassion, accept your imperfections, and be gentle with yourself as you grow and evolve. So, how can we put these ancient teachings into practice in our lives? The Taoists encourage us to follow the middle path, to stay centered and conserve our health. By unlearning something new every day, we allow the universe to reveal itself, reaching a point of inner stillness where we can find contentment. This process, known as the fasting of the heart, leads us to non-action, where nothing is left undone. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time, embrace the wisdom of Taoism and find contentment in the natural flow of life.